In this lesson, we're going to learn how to connect a motor circuit. So these are the apparatus that we require. Okay, we need two battery holders with batteries connected in series, a fan blade, a motor, a gearbox, a switch, and also three wires. So first of all, we need to connect the motor to the gearbox. And this is how we are going to go about doing it. You can see that there is a groove here on the gearbox. And if you look at the motor, there is also uh, a similar groove. So there is this small knob down here. Okay, that will go straight into the gearbox like this. So just slot it in. Okay, and it should fit nicely. And I need you to arrange the apparatus in a certain direction. Okay, because this motor will only work um, properly if you connect it in the right manner. Okay, so I need the two spring connection point of the motor to be facing upwards and I need the battery uh, to be placed in this manner such that the black knob is on the right side. Okay, so now what we can do is that we will connect all the apparatus in a series connection like this. Okay, so this uh, connection point of the motor right is the same as that of the switch just that it's smaller so what we need to do is just bend and slot in the wire and release okay do it for the other side and we are ready to um, complete the entire series circuit right we are done so when I close the switch the motor will spin okay so we can put on the fan blade okay so the fan blade will will turn like a chopper so there's something that's quite cool about this circuit is that you know when the blade is turning right and if you open the switch the blade will launch off okay let me show it to you okay so it launches off like this and I'm going to show you what happens if let's say you do not connect the the wires according to what I told you like if let's say instead of connecting this side to the black knob right if you connect it to the red knob what's going to happen basically when you uh, close the switch right the motor will still spin okay but the problem is that it's not spinning in the other direction because you reverse the polarity of the battery and this fan blade right it is it is made such that it needs to uh, turn in the correct direction so that uh, it catches hold of the motor and it spins continuously so if it spins the other direction right you find that when I close the switch the fan blade it will keep falling off okay it will not spin properly so when this happens right what you need to do right is just to uh, reverse the polarity of the battery to rectify this problem okay and that's it about a motor circuit i hope you have enjoyed it